Hey there, everyone, it's now Cal. Man, like, uh, I finally were done with all the Sonic. Man, that has been quite a wild ride, wasn't it? However, I believe that it was totally worth it. Cause really, like, I'm gonna be honest, the whole reason why I started ATS was basically to give me a socially acceptable gateway into doing all of the Vector, the Crocodile, and finally, Finally, I get my payoff. Yeah, let's go. I talked about everyone, so I didn't hear what they said. Uh, oh, playing Devil May Cry, got it. There's like a light underneath his shoe. Also, he's listening to his own theme song. <laughs> what a lame-o. Yeah. Oh man, that bee has a drum set on him. Don't damage the package. Wow, he's very precise. Look at these cartoon animals. Oh, sweet. Oh, got giant money eyes. You say that with every job, SBO. Besides, you know our policy. We never turn down work to pay. What a scumbag policy. Come on, boys. Let's go. What does that policy mean? What does it involve? Uh, I guess everyone here is kind of kind of cool. With, all right, we gotta find crabs. That's our mission. So yeah, Team Chaotix is like basically mission mode. Yeah, everyone has a weird we variance. Oh, I can barely hear you over the music there. I'm a little polygogile. That's like crocodile. <laughs> we just fall from the sky. That's a plant. I don't remember you. Alright. Wait, it's a plant. Do you have something to do with this? Sure are. I don't know what's going on here. What's that? It's a teleport? Here we go! Where are we? <laughs> uh I guess it was a crown on the floor there. Okay, so I think like we made our way backwards through the level, possibly. Alright, well, okay, so that's the thing. Gotta find ten crabs. We got warp flower, warp disaster. So you you do, oh you turn invisible and your friends don't follow you after you summon a tornado. Naturally. All right. So but you can still summon. There's a crab. It's a hermit crab. Yeah! Quacko bounce. Huh. So there you go. So here you get introduced to the concept of Charmy doing his things. They're clearly fake flowers, though, but they still respond to a bee. So you're like big and that if you attack from the air, you spit your friends. You uh, do a ground pound rather than like throw your, your guys around. I prefer to throw your guys around tactic. Oh, well, keep going. Don't, don't worry here. Voice in the machine. Someone left us. So do you still have... What the hell? Okay. Yo, balloon! <laughs> and everyone just kind of hangs on like a parasite. Good times. Okay, well, you know what? Why not? We got that money. I got... There sure are. Uh, that's right. Slam right back down. Uh, uh. Oh, gee. Scream that music. Scream that music. That's a thing that happens. Look, it's been like two minutes. It's fine. Voice in the box. Alright, we gotta be Espio here. He does not appear to have a, uh, a, a light speed dash. I mean, that's normal. He never got a light speed dash power up. Wow, I didn't notice that on my own, Charmy. Good thing you're here. They left a crab on this colonnade. One day I'll jump up here, maybe. Here we go, he did it. Oh, he thanks the crab for being collected. That's kind of weird. All right, so like, well, I don't know why you slid forward like that, Vector. Like, I pressed the attack button. Didn't expect you to go flying off. No, I want you to spit your friends. How do we arrange for that to happen? I don't know how you work. Like, there's obviously gonna be something up there. Like, why else would there be a very awkward to get to? Maybe, okay, we can go on top of it. Then we can get you smash it up. 
And we realized that inside was money all along. Alright, well, we gotta check the other one now. Like, sorry, it's the law. Don't just put breakable stuff everywhere for no reason. Back door to Crocodile! There's a crab indeed. We're gonna go the SPO way. Go somewhere on the spring, yo. Fly up where there's money. And purse this bubble, maybe. No, we missed. I suppose that's all that's gonna happen today. Sliding rocks is having fun over there. Alright, so I press attack here to load up, and then I can shoot my friend. Okay, so it's one of those load up and then fire kind of mini series. Got it. There's a blue thing over here. Yay, you powered up! SPO! Now everyone is shaking, and no one is reacting. Mm, makes a lot of sense. Oh man, you still don't have any power-ups at all. Charmy to be. Everyone, you gotta tell their animal after their name. It's just natural. Be careful not to fall, you'll fall in the water, which is deadly for alligators. Here we go, of this thing. I think I might want to go up there. Like, it's kind of a little bit harder, kind of, to get to. Look at it. So you got a crate here and everything. Oh, what? Oh, okay then. <laughs> that was very sudden. This is, oh, you won, by the way, bang, <laughs> slap. So yeah, I think that most of the time there are more than necessary in terms of, like if it's a collect all the object kind of mission. And I think like their extra mission is getting actual 100%. Look at that tail wag, I'm pretty sure a real alligator can't do that, nor crocodile. He is an advanced model. Yeah! Not bad. C for Charmy B, who flew around but didn't get the most point. That was Vector, the crocodile, and I mean that's completely normal. It's like it's like the real team leader is the power unit. Like that's so exciting. We should have that more often. Let's run in the clear tube, guys. Here we go. One day. Well, no, yeah. Here we go. Yeah, here we go. We're gonna run forward. That's what we do. Going along this long tube. I feel like it's been a while since I played a bonus. I'm still holding on to to bonus while doing this. Whoa, yeah. I feel like once you go up a wall and you feel trapped, the best thing to do is to just keep going in the same direction and eventually you'll kind of like auto-correct where you want to be. You gotta be SPO to go through this wonder throw. That's a bomb I almost hit, but we won't say to anyone. It's fine, we got the fast running lizard. You know, lizards are well known for being the fastest animals you can find on Earth. So I understand why they would give SPO. Why am I going so slow now? So, now I'm falling? So, I, I had stopped holding forward to go forward and it was working fine. As long as I think I was maintaining my boost, but it stopped once I ran out of boost gauge. Here we go. And surprise, I had a lot more control when I wasn't holding boo uh, the arrow all the time, the joystick all the time. So maybe that's the trick to actually being able to control yourself in these. It's to get enough boost that you don't have to hold forward manually, and they just kind of go forward on their own. I mean, that's why is their winning dance here to just abuse their boss like that, just knocking him over and pushing him around like that's so mean. Come on, like, please be nicer. He's a cool guy. He has a sweet golden chain, and he got four one-ups. That's right, four one-ups, more than one.